beautiful cuts here. Live and direct from Brooklyn, New York. In front of me today, pow, I have a box of 2008, 2009 Upper Deck Series 1 Retail, uh, which is on sale for me to detail. Uh, so the benefit of these old school square boxes would be the fact that they typically are about $30 less than the hobby boxes, yet lo and behold they have the same amount of young guns, mm, less parallels would be the drawback. Uh, I still have a little kitty cat rolling around my legs, so if you hear some rattling around, uh, that would be the sound of the kitty cat rolling around. Uh, configuration, 24 packs per box, 8 cards per pack, which would amount to 192 cards. There are a lot of cards within this puppy here. Uh, base set 1 through 2 honey as we know and then the young guns 2 1 through 2 fitty there are exclusives high gloss printing plates parallels in theory less so in retail more so uh, in detail more so in the hobby boxes uh, so the young guns would be one of four I gather uh, as they typically are which would amount to six cards uh, six young guns so that's what's spectacular about these retail boxes which are a bit cheaper usually go for like some 40 bucks uh, the other thing, base inserts are one in four, base inserts one in four, and those include, I think, Hat Trick Heroes, Winter Classics back in this one here, Sophomore Sensations, I think there were Captain's cards as well, and there should theoretically be uh, a Jersey card, because I believe those would be one in 24, even for uh, the retail boxes. In fact, I think in the hobby boxes there are two Jersey cards, if I recollect uh, correctly. Um, and of course the Young Gun class, we should know by now, is Petrangelo, uh, Stammer, Drew Dowdy, Blake Wheeler, uh, TJ Oshie's in it. Uh, the other, the, actually, you know what, there's a Wayne Simmons who's fresh off of winning the Messi Award. Uh, and some others, like Claude Giroux would be another one worth mentioning. Uh, so here we go. Okay guys, time for the recap. Recap video up in effect. I will be giving this box away, just hashtag bro door. Let's just do it like that. Why not just be cool like that? Uh, so with regard to our stack of base, I uh, feel like popping up on it uh, and changing life all of it so big with this package and stackage, including the Sid the Kid, the Wiz Kid himself, a really dynamic photo as Upper Deck Series 1, Series 2 is wont to do. Uh, and with regard to uh, checklists, we actually received two checklist cards as well. I know they're just base cards, but they're kind of cool looking. There's Marty Brodeur, and there again is Sid the Kid, in effect. Uh, microphone check. We also received a little, I think our inserts, our base inserts are supposed to be one of four, so like some six inserts. We did in fact receive these cool winter classics in 2008, 2009. They had a bunch of winter classic inserts in their products. There, there is Ryan Miller climbing up the leaderboard. Uh, for wins and there is Brian Campbell who of course ended up on Chicago and won the Stanley Cup there and played over a thousand games as well as Ryan Malone who was on your uh, not gold silver uh, Olympic team also with regard to base inserts man we received these here we have Mark Stahl who is the D of the brothers we have this captain's calling of uh, Nick Lidstrom and this Rick Nash hat trick heroes uh, kind of generic uh, inserts from the day, from back in the day, uh, and then I'll, you know, fan them right up there into formation with care. So these two uh, are base inserts, I guess, and they are all Sid the Kid, uh, I believe, on the checklist, uh, as far as I can muster, HH5 and HH6, uh, two Sid Hockey Hero inserts. Uh, what else did we receive? We did receive our, uh, our Upper Deck Game jersey. Boom! Brandon Bell. Uh, who I believe was drafted by the Leafs, thus this particular jersey here. Uh, played about 100 games uh, in the NHL, didn't play too long. Uh, but kind of cool to receive it nonetheless. Uh, if you do buy a box of this stuff for a decent price, perhaps you'll get one of the nicer ones. I know that there are actually some quads. Uh, I don't know if you'll necessarily get it in a retail box, but there certainly are those quads. In terms of our young guns, man, Ansi Samella, who played uh, mostly in the Swedish League in KHL, if I recall. There's Brandon Sutter, who was 11th overall, just an abdulcator. Kyle Poso, so that's kind of cool. Kyle is now on Buffalo, uh, and was the 7th overall, and very quietly has put up, what, some 500 points in the NHL? Something to, to that effect. He's actually had a very nice, uh, quiet career. Uh, Patrick Hornquist, who's a seventh round pick, and he scored the cup winning goal against uh, Nashville when he scored when he won his second Stanley Cup with Pittsburgh, as well as TJ Oshie, uh, the shootout specialist himself, won his cup with uh, with who? With with Washington. 
Um, and he was the 24th overall, correct? Correct. So that basically would be it. Those are our young guns. This is our stackage. I will give this box away. So just hashtag uh, Brodeur and it'll be yours. I also will try to give away uh, something every 100 subscribers. Uh, you can hashtag Dryden for that. So please like, please comment. Uh, please hashtag uh, Dryden if you want to get into the next round of those things or Brodeur for this one. And yeah, man, uh, full cards, man. Live <laughs> direct from a place called Brooklyn, New York. Didn't I give you everything?